Today you will learn how to create your own NFT on the Atomic Hub platform. We'll walk you through everything step by step. So after watching this video, you will not have any problems with creating an NFT. Subscribe to the Krypton channel and let's get started. We will create an NFT on Atomic Hub, the link to which you will find in the description. And we will use WAX blockchain for this. However, the Atomic Hub platform also supports the EOS blockchain. And if it is more convenient for you, you can create your own NFT using this blockchain. All actions in this case will be exactly the same. First, log in into your WAX account on the Atomic Hub webpage or create a new account and go to the NFT Creator tab. You will see this interface. Many actions in the WAX blockchain require a resource called RAM. You can get more RAM by purchasing it in the WAX Speed tokens by clicking on Buy More. For all actions, you will need at least at least 10 WaxP tokens, which you can purchase on the KuCoin Exchanger or Huobi, links to which you will find in the description. Or use the function of buying WaxP directly from your credit card by going into your Wax wallet and clicking on Buy WaxP. There you will find two services for buying WaxP. To start our work with NFTs, you need to create a collection by clicking on Create New Collection. By analogy, we can see that a collection is a brand of sneakers, for example, Nike or Adidas. You will see a window like this. First, add a thumbnail for your collection. Other users will see it like this. To create an NFT, you will need to fill these three mandatory fields. Name your collection. It must be 12 characters long. It can consist of numbers from 1 to 5 and small Latin letters. This name will be used when searching for a collection, so think carefully about it. Basically, it is like a tag. Then, create your collection as you want everyone to see it. As the third mandatory step, it remains only to specify the amount of the commission that you will receive for each purchase of your NFT. For example, if you set a commission of 6% and someone sells your NFT worth of $100, then from this operation you will receive $6. If you wish, you can also add a link to a website and write the description for your new collection. There are additional functions in the NFT Atomic Hub creation interface, which you can learn about more by clicking on the show advanced details. The first of these may come in handy if you are a member of organization, and the access to the collection management must be granted to several people. With the help of the second additional function, you can add users who need to be notified about the changes in the collection. After filling in all the desired fields, click on Create Collection and confirm the transaction. You can edit the created collection by clicking on Edit Collections. The next step in creating an NFT is to create a scheme. Coming back to analogies, a scheme is something like a sneaker model, like the Air Force One or Air Jordan. Each shoe model has its own characteristics, its attributes. For example, the color of the shoe, the color of the laces and the color of the sole. Each shoe of a certain model has these characteristics. They are different for each shoe. For example, Air Jordan shoes may be red with red soles and black laces or be blue with black soles and black laces. Similarly, NFTs belonging to the same scheme of the same model have the same attributes but different values of these attributes, creating a new scheme. First, give it a name, up to 12 characters long, and then go to the block of attributes in which by default there will be only a name and an image. Attributes are properties of your future NFT. For example, in addition to the standard name and image, you can add rareness, description or any other property. For example, another image to use it as the back of the NFT card. In our case, as an example, we'll add a description by clicking on Add New Attribute and choosing the attribute type text in the drop-down menu. After filling in all the desired fields and adding all the attributes, click Create Scheme and confirm the transactions. You can add new attributes after creating the scheme. Now you can create your NFT by clicking on Mint New Asset. But before that, we'll go through the creation of templates, which will greatly simplify and speed up the creation of your future NFTs. On the page that opens, add images of the future template, and make sure that the hash of the image has been calculated. Then specify the maximum emission, the maximum number of NFTs that can be issued using this template. Two options to the right of the emission value allows you to enable or disable transfers to a few NFTs as well as their burning. You can leave both options active. The only thing that remains is naming your template. Add a description or other attributes that you added to the previously created scheme and complete the creation of the template by clicking on Create Template and then confirm the transaction. The template will be created and the further NFT creation will be very easy. To do this, click on Mint New Asset. Select the template. Images and all attributes will be added automatically. You just have to specify how many NFT will be minted on this batch. 
click on create asset, check summary information and confirm the issue. NFTs will immediately appear on the scheme page and you can immediately put your NFTs for sale by clicking on the list on market. The method of issuing NFTs using templates is the simplest and fastest. With it you can flexibly control an issuance of NFTs and monitor their emission. Take full advantage of cryptocurrencies and subscribe to our Twitter Krypton. All the links will be in the description. Krypton is your ultimate guide in the crypto world and have a nice take.